Well, here's a uh, goat project. This is one of the triplets, and it was near death yesterday. And uh, it's been in the house overnight and got it back going. It is finally taking a bottle. So I guess it's going to become a bottle baby. Not my favorite thing to do, but uh, there we go. heading to the barn and the last uh, doe of the early ones just kitted so gonna come out and get the navel sprayed with iodine got to repair a bulb in the barrel so they've got heat and uh, we'll turn the heaters on for just a little bit but there they are just uh, just born, just a few minutes old. <laughs> One of the things we do is spray the navel good to prevent any kind of infection. That's a little boy. Had to peel some of that afterbirth off. Well, it's a uh, 34 degree morning, misty morning here in Southern Indiana. And uh, last night had our last set of twins on the early kidders. Uh, one male, one female. The male is a really stout uh, uh, kid. Uh, the bottle kid that we have, uh, I've decided at my age, I do not want real kids. That goat kid was, uh, took a bottle at nine o'clock, took one at one o'clock, and took one at uh, about 420. And uh, it was because it really wanted a bottle then and I couldn't get it to be quiet. So I had to get up and uh, feed it. And then it uh, took another one about 830 this morning. So right now I am on the way to the feed mill to get uh, goat feed and some horse feed. And we'll uh, see what the rest of the day holds after that. <laughs> 